Demo 9.16, Complete STO. In this demo, we will complete the steps for our stock transport order. In the Goods Movement menu, select Transaction MIGO, GI, Goods Issue, MIGO. The system displays the Goods Issue Purchase Order screen. Verify that the movement type and storage location are correct and that the Item OK box is checked. Next, click the Save icon to post the Goods Issue. The system displays the document number in the bottom left corner of the screen. Note this number and then click the back icon to return to the SAP Easy Access menu. We will now post the goods receipt for the goods issued for the STO. In the For Purchase Order menu, select Transaction MIGO PO Number Known. Verify that the movement type and storage location are correct and that the Item OK box is checked. Next, click the Save icon to post the goods receipt. The system displays the document number in the bottom left corner of the screen. Note this number and then click the back icon to return to the SAP Easy Access menu. With the goods received for our STO, we will now check the stock balance at the shipping and receiving plants. In the Stock menu, select Transaction MB52, Warehouse Stock. Enter the appropriate data in the Material Plant and Storage Location fields. Then click the Execute icon to view the stock balance. The screen indicates that there are now 40 bikes in the San Diego plant. Click the back icon to return to the previous screen. Change the plant field to the Dallas plant, then click the Execute icon to continue. The system indicates that the balance in the Dallas plant has decreased by 30, the same amount that the inventory in the San Diego plant increased by. Click the back icon twice to return to the SAP Easy Access menu. With the stock increase at the San Diego plant, we will now view the storage bin stock balance. In the Display menu, select Transaction LX03 Bin Status Report. Enter the warehouse number, storage type, and storage bin, then click the Execute icon to continue. The overview screen displays the storage bin that fits our search specifications. Double-click the storage bin number to view it. In the Display Storage Bin screen, we will see that there has been no balance increase. Click the back icon twice to return to the Bin Status Report initial screen. Next, we want to determine whether the materials are in the interim storage area. Enter the Stock Transport Document number and click the Execute icon. The overview screen displays the storage bin that matches the search specifications. Double-click on the storage bin number to display it. In the Display Storage Bin screen, we will see that the interim storage area contains the 30 bikes that were received when the goods receipt was posted. Click the back icon three times to return to the SAP Easy Access menu. We will now view the finished goods account balance to see whether it changes as a result of the materials movement. In the account menu, select Transaction FAGLB03, Display Balances, New. Enter the account number, company code, and fiscal year. Next, click the Execute icon to view the account balance. The balance display shows the debits and credits that are posted to this account. Double-click the debit balance to view the line items. The system displays the line items that have been debited to this account. The goods issue document is posted here. 
Click the back icon to return to the previous screen. Double click the credit balance to view the line items posted here. The goods issue is also posted here because the transfer of material between plants does not decrease or increase the overall account balance. Demo 9.16 Complete STO